These are some healthy habits you need in your life. Okay, let's do it. Woo! Stretching 10 minutes every day is so beneficial to your lifestyle because it increases flexibility, increases range of motion, improves your performance and physical activities, increases blood flow to your muscles, improves posture, helps to heal and prevent back pain. My schedule counts one foot, and then I make the other one. I tried coconut milk with matcha. Okay, so half of the time I eat dairy products in my things. Dairy can break you out because the whey and the casein, which are the proteins in milk, stimulate growth and hormones in calves. In us, when we drink the milk, we digest these proteins and then they release a hormone similar to insulin and this is the hormone known to trigger breakouts. Another fun habit I recently started doing is sticky noting my walls. This changes the game, let me just tell you, oh my gosh. Basically the idea of this is you write down each of the things that you have to do on a separate sticky note. Once you finish with one thing, take it off. It's done. Look how close we are to clearing them all off. It's just supposed to motivate you to want to get things done. By the end of the day, the goal is to not have any stickies on your wall. Got this idea from Annie Long, so... I'm the type of person who can't keep their room clean, so what I do is clean it every day right before I go to bed. I just have more of a positive mindset when I'm waking up to a clean room. On most nights, I write down my schedule for the day so that I can make the most use out of it. And also, having my schedule written down the night before makes productive things more likely to happen. The first thing you do when you wake up, I think sets the tone for the whole entire day. It's really changed my life not going on my phone first thing in the morning. When I used to go on social media first thing in the morning, it's kind of like I'm playing catch up. Like, what did I miss? Who posted? To prevent myself from going on my phone first thing in the morning, I charge my phone in a separate room. It sounds simple, but it actually really helps me. It's great. Set a timer for five minutes. Time blocking and utilizing your calendars and your timers is super crucial to having a productive day, in my opinion, because if I don't set a timer for something, I can be doing that for one hour. Type frequencies are constant. Unless there's some type it's really helped me stay on task and stay focused. Even if you're just home alone, I think it's so beneficial to spray a bunch of perfume everywhere. It's just gonna make you so happy. In my mind, you look good, you feel good, whatever that means to you. Maybe it doesn't mean putting makeup on, maybe it does. Blue light glasses, really good. For some reason, I feel super luxurious if I pick out the clothes I'm gonna wear the night before. I try to make journaling one of my habits. When I journal, it's kind of like brain dumping. All I know is that after I journal, I feel better. <laughs> Cutting veggies and fruit and having them ready to go makes eating healthy a lot easier and a lot more accessible. You don't have any excuse if the peppers and the celery is already cut. You don't have to do anything else, just eat it. It's been super helpful saying I get to do things rather than I have to do something. For example, doing homework, you could complain and say, oh, I have to do homework and it's so stupid. Or you can reverse the thought and think, wow, I get to learn, I get to become educated and that will just take me places. That will change your life if you think about things like that. Yes.